Alright, this is Demon Eclipse with the new update to Firefall. Six months later, um, I guess there's supposed to be a cutscene there, which didn't actually play. We've already read this, we're going forward. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Major updates to this is a new leveling system, new combat system, just new practically everything, I guess. NDA is not applicable at the moment, so I don't have to worry about that. Still in Copacabana. I'm not sure what uh, it, optimizations they have made to the graphics in as much as usual. Loading, 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 and we move forward, I think. Loading screen change, we know that. Public beta build 1409R 46953. Um, memory use just under 1 gig. Kilobytes per second, ping rate. Hmm. I think I'm in a good aspect ratio right now. Okay. This is the old intro intro. Sin uplink established. Remote team members online. Boss, wake up. You'll be landing at Copacabana soon, boss. It's a great place for a vacation, but we need to pay the bills first. Let's see if we can find some work here. Coming into the city now. Hold on, I'll bring her around. Don't worry. Once we get hooked into Sin, I'll scan the local feed. We'll find something. And it looks like everything is going forward. I don't know what that freeze was about. I hope it didn't um, desync the audio like it usually does because it wasn't uh boss the shared intelligence network is still down over much of this region we will have to patch it manually to receive missions and to get data flow i'm pinging you a waypoint where the sin tower is located near the center of the resort okay now they got rid of the medic and now you have the biotech biotech main weapon is a. Uh... Machine gun with a shotgun secondary fire. Objective waypoint found. Spicy else tuna still here. Everything seems a bit jumpy, you know. Beta is beta. Battle frame station and core biotech. I don't want to be a biotech. This is your battle frame garage. Here you can sell, modify, or purchase any battle frame you are licensed to pilot. You can also customize any I don't of your want to be battle a battle frame. tech. The equipment you install will require a balance of weight, power, or CPU from your battle frame. Just be careful not to exceed your battle frame's maximum capabilities in these three fields. Okay, so you got battle, you got power, weight, and CPU powder power. 1190 ml. Why don't they just go with megahertz or gigahertz? Seriously. I got gigawatt 200, 2,887 gigawatts of power capacity, 4,784 kilograms. That seems a little bit much. An Accord Bio Needler. Clip? Range? Eh, interesting. Ammo? Accord Ammo. Interesting. Secondary weapon is the cord grenade launcher. Ammo for that is again a cord ammo. Free ammo, I guess. Maybe able to change that later, but I'm absolutely certain. Okay. So that is. Do I? Can I turn it? Okay. Reactor. Presumably it changes the amount of power I have. An accord bioreactor. Doesn't add any CPU, doesn't use any CPU. I'm assuming the CPU is this part, the main plating here. Cord plating, specialty, got nothing. I think they may have to redo this a little bit, but it feels a, it feels a heck of a lot better than it did before. Jump jet servos. The servos would give you speed, I guess. Resume. 
Unfortunately, I started off with a biotech, not a jug, uh, dreadnought like I light wanted to. Now you can only start off with one class. And if you want more, you can get more. Though I'm happy they did change the movement speed because we're actually kind of moving quickly now. It's not natural. Reading a strong melding signature. Hooray! It's a twist. Whatever it is, this steez bubble is going crazy where you are. That's it. We're in. Now we can see all the traffic in this area and receive messages in Copacabana. Be gone. Open up your map. See the green circle around Copacabana? That's the range of this Sin Tower. The more towers we find, the more of the map we'll uncover. I'm also directly patched into your Sin feed. I can see what you see. Picking up this an emergency transmission. This is probably one of those live events they were talking about. Uh, this is Ratchet in Copacabana Engineering. Damn! Our water's been Ten cut frames off. a second! Too much crap to going on! We need somebody to aqueduct valves to carry the water from the moisture farms. Can you help? We have to help them. The melting has destroyed all of the other moisture farms in this area. If this one goes down, Copacabana won't have any water. Ratchet, we're on it. Thanks, please hurry. Picking up some trace elements. Boss, that thing is one giant pinata full of crystite hybrids. Try destroying those orbiting shards. What orbiting shards? There are no orbiting sh shards. All that I know is that I pretty much have to lower my graphical fidelity or else I will not be able to see anything. <laughs> There's too much crap going on. <laughs> I've, oh, um tell you the truth, I have no idea what my graphics are like right now because I can't set them up unless I'm in full screen and I really don't want to do that. I'm just going to set everything to low. And I know it'll look like crap, but I should at least be able to see something now. What's this? I have no idea what this is. Oh, whatever. Oh, that's the new sign for the um, thingamabobs. I don't know. I think it just got darker. Watch out! That valve is venting badly. Hurry, see if you can shut it off. One second, let me do a remote scan to find the damage. This valve station is ruined. Uh, I see the data now. What a mess. Clear out some of these Aranas so they stop mucking around with my valves. The melding is changing all the wildlife making them more aggressive. These Aranyas from Alpha Prime are especially dangerous. I like the changes they made to the medic, but I'm not sure if it's viable as a healer now. And a lot of people are asked, wondering what the heck they meant by orbiting shards, just like I was. I have no idea what it means by orbiting shards. And I know, I realize it's kind of dark, there's not a lot I can do with about that with this huge battle going on and I really can't see anything. I can either not see anything, or go so slow that I die, so... Right now I'm just supposed to kill 20 Aranhas. Aran Aran Why won't they come up with a decent name for those things? Does that actually do anything to them? Because it doesn't seem to be doing any damage. around so damn fast, so it's a lot more hectic and fun than it was, which was the biggest thing, really. So everything moves so dang slow that it's just boring. There's so many people right now, it's not even funny. And it doesn't seem like we actually get any experience for just helping to kill something. We actually have to kill it now. Halfway there. We have to thin them out. I like this shotgun mechanic with this gun. Are you? Okay. 
Where's the freaking ammo? I picked up something. It wasn't ammo. Ammo. Meet me in Copacabana. You've taken care of the Iranas, but we still got to get that water flowing. I've got a plan. Well, they finally make Ratchet look like she does in her picture. That's the biggest question I have. So I think they made the move movement a bit more dynamic. You're actually running now instead of jogging. Oh, dang it. Is that frame rate issues or... Whoa. Ping, I guess. I think that... I think this is ping issues. Like it keeps on going to ping kilobytes a second and costs, whatever the heck that is. What does she got? Sonic detonators. Is that something? Is that a blueprint I buy or something else? I don't know. Health. Is there an ammo pickup station thingy here? There we go. Ammo. Reload. Ratchet. Ah, they really hey. chewed this thing up. The MPU is ruined. I'm gonna need some silicate fragments to make a new one. I detected some silicate deposits down by the that? beach, but we're going to need something to get to the silicates inside. Here, take these sonic detonators. I was saving them in case the Chosen invaded, but you can use them to blast open the silicate deposits. Hey boss, oil spill here. Use the call down menu on your nav wheel to access the sonic detonators. It contains things you picked up for special Whoa. missions, like them detonators. Interesting. Huh. I like this. A sin bridge. Used to hack a battle frame sin to see it into the beyond. That is rather freaky. Flares. Accord flares used to provide light in an area. I guess I am going to be able to use those in the future. Pack of Sonic Detonators. I need 100 Christite. It's fine. I got some. Let's see if I can turn up the... Make it a bit brighter for you guys. Should be able to... Dynamic resolution, FPS, V-Sync, anti-aliasing, sun shafts, inclusion. Yeah, I can't really change anything while I'm in this mode. Right now I'm playing Windows, uh, so that's why. I'm detecting a silicate deposit so nearby. Like Do you see it? Oil spill here. Target the deposits with your sonic detonators, and you'll extract those silicates right out. Ammo. Yeah, I can't see anything. Wait, I know there's a flashlight. What button was it? There we go! Flashlight! Whoa! May I just say that this gun feels like it was manufactured by Mattel? There we go. our first silicate fragment. We're going to need more if Ratchet is going to fix the Aqueduct MPU. I wonder if it's just that no one else has their everything. flashlight on, or... I can't believe the Aegis is still four light years away. And I'm planning to be numero uno in the waiting list when it arrives. Goodbye melding, goodbye Earth. Uh, shush. Hope is taken one step at a time. Will you guys please stop arguing? 
overall everything feels a heck of a lot better. The only problem I have is that you do not start with every battle frame. I don't like that I can't kill him, the little guys, in one blast from my shotgun. night I, I like games with like 15 15 minute day and night cycles because it just seems to make more sense up, up and away we go there's gotta be another one around here somewhere and we're just waiting around for the dang things to respawn okay so They turn it into a skill now or what? Because I seem to be throwing a lot of these things. Oh, dang it, it's not powerful enough. Silicate fragment as well. This guy doesn't have much of an arm on him, does he? Oh, Threat. There. There we go. Everyone's talking we about. We found it. another one. Just a couple more. Did they finally remove those annoying ass areas where you could just walk off the side of the freaking planet? I'm bored. Uh, 
Everything's a bit more satisfying, but it just takes too long to find all these freaking deposits. I understand you want us to get familiar with the running system, but like, it shouldn't take this long. Oh, nice. Good. We have all the fragments we need. This should allow Ratchet to rebuild the MPU and get the water flowing to Copacabana. Let's go find Ratchet. that they gave us a lot more power for our jetpacks as well. Hey, you found them all. Bring them over, and I'll show you not how you can build like the MPU. Beauty. Use the molecular printer over there, and I'll show you how to put it together. Whatever. Bet you've never used an Omnidyne M jet before. But with the silicates you found, you'll be able to construct a replacement MPU by printing molecules layer by layer. Load the manufacturing station with the MPU template. It should take only a matter of seconds until it's built and ready to unload. Whoa! You mean you gave me a template rather than researching it? Whatever. Just so long as I do not have to be online when I'm researching stuff, I do not mind. Because that I tried that with, um... What was it? Black Prophecy? I can't even remember what the game was called. And bingo, Bob's your uncle. It's done. We'll need to take this to the Master Valve Station Mobile and install it. Station? It'll Pack propagate the changes to the other valves via SYN and Advanced everything should be fixed up. Stalker Careful stalker. though, the installation creates quite a racket. Likely to attract the undesirables. Yeah, whatever. Running! Glider packs will change any. like cash, so please spend it wisely. Ammo? Maybe you drop ammo! I picked up some purple stuff, whatever that was, I don't know. It's in place. It's going to take some time to integrate into the valve mechanism. Looks like you've attracted some attention. Hold them off. Almost! Hardware install is 75% complete. So 
why couldn't I just slot this thing in and press a button? I love how much power I have now. Oh, you've done it. The water's flowing again. Oh, why don't you come by Copacabana and I'll buy you a drink? Hey, I might still need your help. The water's flowing, but not nearly fast enough. What do you mean? The resort was never designed to handle as many people as the Accord brought in when they occupied the place. I'm gonna have to turbo boost these pumps, but I need pure seed crystite to do it. I am sure you could requisition the Accord for some. Not bloody likely. The Accord is hoarding every resource it can find. We've got to scavenge our own seed crystite, and we'll need a thumper for that. Luckily, I found a wrecked one that I've been fixing up. I just need Tiki. <laughs> Tiki? My wrecking drone. Tiki can find Ouch. almost anything. I upgraded blood? his scanners myself. I sent him out on a scan, but he hasn't returned yet. So I'm uploading three of his most recent locations to your sin map. You find Tiki, and I'll get to work restoring the thumper. Stop spawning behind me! Why is it not daytime yet? spot he must be close what are those bubbles coming from the pools let's investigate y you'll never find him with those big scavengers around he's hiding from them you'll need to take them out first Things scary. They look a lot better though. There's a big one. Eight, three, eight. Stay put, you ugly son of a... No importa. He'll turn up eventually. Oh, Let's stop, try the stop, next stop. place. That's important. Sure. You want to go against the giant scavenger this predator thing? This place is thingies? creepy. I don't understand why a drone would like to hide here. I like the new changes to the mini-map. It's gonna be the last place I look. I don't there. think the little guy is here. We should try somewhere else. Wow, is... We're in the general area Rachid indicated through Sin. But where could he be?
physical health at 50%. That stupid little... Yeah, I'm getting out of here. I don't want to fight one of those damn things again. They're really easy to kill, but they're annoying. Cleats, my good sir. Cleats! There he is. We found Tiki, but it looks like he's pretty Ouch. beat up. Leave me he's alone. keeping off the ground. Who says we need a stinking scanning drone? All we need is the scan hammer that it's carrying. Scan hammer? Scan hammer, scanner, scanner hammer, whatever. Call it what you want. Every drone's got one. We'll have to give it back to Ratchet, but at least it's something. Good idea, oil spill. Just trying to make myself useful and all. Boss, Ratchet sent us three locations where she suspects there to be a high yield of seed crystite. Head over to one and use Ratchet's scan hammer to see if we can find anything. If you want to use the scan hammer, just equip it and slam that puppy on the ground. It'll ignite a seismic wave through the rock and dirt and forward its readings to your sin. If you find something, it'll show up on your sin. If not, just keep looking. Freak. Okay, so experience is not experience. You do not level up per snake. Experience is cash to get different shit, I guess. That's kind of it, I guess. Okay, scan hammer. Looks like the first hammer strike worked. If you found a node, call down the thumper. If not, Keep looking. When you find a mineral node with thumper your hammer, incoming. use the thumper beacon to call it down. The thumper okay, so will automatically start digging up those resources and storing them aboard its hull. There's just one thing you need to know about thumpers. They're loud and notorious about irritating the wildlife. So make sure to keep it guarded from piranhas or anything worse, or you'll be shopping for a new one. Why is it still night? I do not like long night cycles. Will you Feet. Nope. Uh, bugger. No longer hurts anything. 
75%. I simply do not have the kind of ammo necessary for this bullshit. Check out them PvP terminals in town. There's plenty of money to be made in home gang. We're fighting back mercenary forces, I can promise you that. Dumper launches go. Great work, boss. Just doing our job. Okay. I do not like how it takes so many grenade hits to kill something. idea how long this has gone on for. Bugger. I can and will get up there. Who the heck does 
design this level. Tasted one of our many on, fine on, on. cafes. Dang, there's a lot more people running around here. So many NPCs. Load, and then research scanning and thumper technology. It gives me a minute, okay. Let's just run over to Spicy Pete's Tunars, whatever it's called. Battleframe garage. Let's see what we can get. Okay, new battle frame cost CY. What the frick is CY? I really would like to know. Okay, new battle frame dreadnought. So you can have three primary battle frames, it looks like. And you can dump them if you choose, except for your primary, which you start off with. Arm signature weapon, the cord heavy machine gun. Ammo for it is this cord standard ammo. Why would uh, I still don't know? Secondary weapon is the cord assault rifle with the standard ammo. Body plating, standard accord plating, specialty, nothing, processor, accord battle, dreadnought processor, ability one, accord repulsor blast, knock back enemies, ability two, non, am I missing something here? No, I don't think I am. Most perturbatory. Jump jet standard. Everything's standard right now, so why don't we just resume? Okay. Okay. Now, there is a menu for this. I'm going to adjust that later. That's not it. Friends list, that's... Oh. Here you can view all of the available upgrades for your battle frame. Select an Accord Tech license to view more information and unlock it with the experience you've accumulated. Okay. So I got the Biotech and the Dreadnought right now. Okay, why is this looking so different? Okay. Okay, so you gotta go through, let's see, and go to this, unlock it horizontal like. How come it says I have enough when I'm going with my biotech? Okay, so technically this is all parts that you unlock for the ultra dense, dense combustion. Asterix ammo uses a dense high impact casing for increased weapon damage. Uh huh. Okay. Okay, I swear these cost exact same. Yeah, they do cost the exact same. So why can't I unlock them on my dreadnought? Hmm. Yeah, I have. 12,000 experience available at the moment.
Okay, I think it's part of the um, beginning crap. Okay, so that's plus jump height. No, accord poison tail. Accord healing ball. I want the healing ball. Fantastic! Looks like you've earned a great upgrade. To take advantage of your new gear, head to the nearest garage terminal to modify your battle frame. Okay, and just to point out, that was T that I pressed in order to get to the skill leveling menu. So, let's see. Okay, then I gotta go back to my biotech, and then I unlocked um, uh, an ability, I think it was. Yeah, ability to court healing ball. Fire is a healing ball that heals anyone it bumps into and can be shot uh, to heal in AoE. Okay. ridiculous upgrade because it was completely freaking useless the healing ball <laughs> that's ridiculous let me just say again that that is ridiculous why can I not Unlock anything from a dreadnought. Zero XP available. I just spent three. Oh, I see. I see. I see. I see. Yeah, it's still got that stupid not uh, you experience for experience, not experience for everything. This guy's heavy. <laughs> Yeah, they need to work on his boosters a little bit. Unload. Accept. Yeah, I think this has gone on for quite a long time. What is that? Oh, it's just bad rendering. in front of me. I can still get headshots with this thing. I know there's a thumper nearby, but tell me what's in the ground. Most useless ability ever. Ah, 
visible surface. Nothing has unlimited ammo.
Sulfur extraction complete. Look at all the carnage just going and going and going. I already have 3,000 experience or so. So, maximum carnage, yes. Yes. Thumper incoming. There should be a good another good thump in here. That is really interesting. Thumper 
extraction complete. So far, some parts of the games haven't changed as much. Some have changed quite a bit. I like the new mechan the new flying mechanics. Anyways, makes it much, much easier to get around when I want to. Reloading. Everything seems a lot more visceral. The sound quality went up quite a bit. And I apologize, but I do not believe I'm in 16 by 9 standard format. I have no idea what stand, what format I'm currently in. But I'm going to release it as 16 by 9, 1280 by 720. Glider pads are cheap, sweet. Ouch. So N pretty much brings up any quests that are currently going on. Because that's the notification. Let's just go through these buttons. C is still doing that. X is still flashlight. Z is still active function. L does... Okay. K, Q for PPP. That's what she's weapons. I do not quite agree with their decision to change the um it looks like they're trying plan planning on uh, expanding this quite a bit okay the accord remains a large mint customer of Manifa. Uh, according for more sales, uh, blah, 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 such. Okay, I think I had Thunderdome at one point, but right now I really want the um, turret mode. Accelerated armatures, better guns, better assault rifle, better rate of fire. I'd rather have a shotgun. Particle collision modeling. <laughs> Plasmatic cooling systems? Reload speed better, plasmatic composites, better defense, BF ballistics, um, yeah. My question is, if you unlock a secondary in one tier, does that mean you can use it in another? Rerouting plasmatics, assault battle frames. I don't currently have any assault battle frames, so that's a small problem. It looks like the main idea, just go over to the garage here. Tech license tree. Why is there no easy return button from the tech license tree? That's uh, the exit button. Wonderful. Okay. I'm sorry, but it just looks like the dreadnought is so much more comfortable. And discard as you please and court assault battle frame then you got the engineer and recon and it looks like you will be able to um, unlock more soon relatively anyways and then once you unlock everything I'm still trying to figure out what this one 1,000 it's probably 1,000 Christite it's probably what I'm seeing here because it would be nice if you could unlock a secondary shotgun, like say, overexcited much. 
be nice if you could unlock a secondary, like say shotgun in the dread frame, and then use it in a different frame. It'd also be nice if the secondary, most of the secondary weapons still didn't have, well, had unlimited ammo still, simply because, well, it's a pain in the ass when all your weapons fall run out of ammo, because the enemies still drop a huge amount of health pickups, but they don't drop as much ammo anymore. At least that's how I see it. It's nice that you can get much higher with these things. I still don't think you can take fall damage. Let's test that, shall we? I can get higher than this. I can get higher than this. Let's see if I die. I could go into the fire. I know I'll burn from that, or at least you used to be able to. Okay. Bets on dying? <clears throat> Oh, I just got hurt, barely. 577 damage. Well, at least we know the battle frames help with falling. Yeah, Spicy Ale's Tuna. It's nice that they also added the heavy sound effects, because it looks like you're wearing a ton of armor, so it's not like, pip, 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 thump, 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 thump. It wants to be thump, 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 thump. Sin Shield Generator. What do you do? I've yet to figure that out. Killed me. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how to use that either, my good friend. That doesn't work. And not anymore, anyways. <laughs> okay. It looks like everything's going to be more based on... Um, It looks like there's much to use this stuff on. Okay, I can't get anything from her. Yes, I'm already healed. You can leave me alone now. <laughs> call down vendor. But she's only got the one call down. The what is this? Anomalous silicate fragment. This may not be silicate. It looks like some sort of technology. Well, let me think. What could it possibly Thank be? You. Hey, they finally got most of the voice acting done. Which is good. Okay. Um. Okay, why am I still at the call down vendor? Why am I still at the call down vendor? What the fucker is this? Bug. Ratchet's not. Your business is appreciated. Okay, I'm trying to figure out what the hell's going on here. Because, in all honesty, I should just be able to... Like, why is there... Why is that... Okay, that, that's probably a bug. No, I don't want to play PvP at the moment. Anyways. They've added a lot of features all over the place. The, the shooting feels a lot better than it used to feels a lot faster than it used to, and in general, just a lot more fun. This went on for quite a long time, a bit too long in my opinion. And yeah, someone's testing out Thunderdome. Make 30 second reload on that, it's not very good. Yeah, well, the game keeps on freezing up on me. Beta is beta, as we all know. Should know at this point, anyways. <laughs> that's kind of nice. There's a light animation going along with the gun. I don't think that's actually necessary, but it's nice that they put it in. kind of liked it before. But that's pretty much my own opinion. So, um, yeah, I, I like the new patch for the most part. I'll probably be pay playing this a lot more.
but it's still not a lot of story going on. There's another mission right after this one a lot of people were talking about, in which you get to drive around on a bike. I'm not exactly sure how I'd go about starting that. So... Yeah. I'll try to check that out another day, but... As towards this Flashpoint gameplay um, episode, I don't care what you want to call it. It looks like they took all, out the most of the actual textures, though. I gotta play this in full screen just to make sure everything's working correctly, because it looks like instead of resizing everything to fit into the screen I, size I chose, they just cropped, which isn't very good. So, this has been Demonocalypse. Thank you for watching.